Maybe call the one minute out. I want to talk to you about something that's fairly basic, but I think is overlooked. And you know, maybe I've got a little shortcut that can help you out. So let's start with loading our magazines, right? Um, we've got our magazines that we get from our manufacturer. This is a magazine for my new PDP from uh, Walther. And I've got my ammo here. Now with every box, you're gonna get a little mag loader. And this one is for nine millimeter or 40 cal. And you can see inside of this, there's basically a little finger there that when you place it over the magazine and you push down on the top, it's going to move that follower down in the magazine, which is going to help you and allow you to load your ammo in there. All right. So the way that this works is I would place this over the magazine. I will push down and then that allows freely that ammo to start inside of the magazine as it catches in there. I just lift up so that it's out of the way and then you can push your round in there. So when you have multiple rounds that you want to load, you just push that pushes the round out of the way. We drop the next one in there, lift up a little bit and it's able to slide in, All right? And that right there is gonna allow you to load your magazine fairly quickly and save your thumb. Now, another method, once you get used to this, you can do this with just your thumb. So what I normally do is I'll take my ammo and I'll just dump a bunch in my hand and then I'll just hold it next to me and I just utilize my thumb to push down on the round to start it. And then you come in from the top and then just push the round back. So as you load in, you push down, load back. So you're basically doing the same thing as what that device does, but now you can do it by hand. And after doing this for a while, you will notice that your thumb will get a little bit sore, but the more that you shoot, the more time you spend on the range, the easier this will get and you will get pretty quick with it. All right, so once we have our magazine loaded, now we need to either carry them in our spare mag holders and or put it in the pistol. Let's talk real quick about our spare magazine holders. So as you can see here, I'm running a dual magazine holder from CNG Holsters and I've got my magazines that are loaded and ready to go in there so that I can do range drills or I have that spare magazine on me in an everyday carry situation, you know, where I want to run through different mag change drills. Here's one key thing that we need to remember is the orientation that we put our magazines inside of our mag holder. We always want it to be consistent and be the same so that we go and reach for our next magazine that the rotation, the movements are always the same to load that magazine. So I like to run mine sideways inside. Some guys will run them uh, and the CNG holsters allow you to do that where you can either mount them to the side or you can mount them forward. Right? I always mount mine to the side, but if you notice, good rule to remember is the bullets always face my center line. Right? So here, the bullets are facing my center line. Both magazines are in there the same way. Right? And then if I had my rifle mag on the back, that mag holder from CNG, same exact thing. Those bullets are facing the center line of my back so that when I reach back there and go to present the magazine, it goes straight in and it's oriented in the right direction. So we'll start with that. Bullets to the center line, they're both in there the same exact way. Now let's talk about how we're gonna load our pistol. So we've loaded our magazine, right? Obviously the bullets are gonna face forward when they go into our pistol. And there's a couple different ways that we can do this. All right, number one, I need to feed the magazine into the magwell, just slam it home so that it clips. We shouldn't have to bang three or four times. Everybody should have enough strength in their hand just to get it started inside the magwell, just send it home. Now I need to go ahead and chamber my first round so that I can start shooting on the range, shoot my drills, or for how I carry my everyday pistol, it's loaded and ready to go. Two different ways that we can do this. I can either rack the slide, either grab from the rear, over the top, all right? Some guys will grab from the, the uh, grooves and the serrations that are on the front, all right? We can rack back, go forward, and make sure that it's in there. All right, I also like to do a little bit of a check so we'll pull back slightly on the slide just to make sure so I can see that round in there and I know that it is seated. All right, another option that we can do is before we load our magazine, we could actually just lock our slide to the rear, all right, using our slide lock on the side. We send our magazine up in and then with our thumb, we just manipulate that slide release. It sends the slide forward and picks up the next round. All right, we wanna ensure that we either then check it and make sure it's in there. Or when it goes forward, we're looking as it goes forward so we see it actually pick up the round and it's ready to go. So now we have our magazines loaded. We know how we're gonna carry our magazines. 
we loaded our magazine a couple different ways into our Walther pistol, and then we're going to look and holster. Now we're ready to go train for the day or carry for our everyday situation.